Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. How are you reading this formation, Jim Beglin? Well, it's a formation, Peter, that lends itself to good possession and control in midfield because you've got the numbers there, a higher concentration. Backing that up with enough attacking dynamism is down to managers who want to get at teams. It can be used in cautious terms too, but certainly if you want to advance a little quicker and you have that attitude, then you can be very positive about this too. So that's got things on the way. Throw it. He's got options out wide. Gets it back. That's a promising ball. Decent strike, kept it fizzing low. I actually like to see that in shots at goal when there's a, a noticeable effort to get over the ball and, and keep it down. Good challenge, he just stood firm. He's picked him out. The referee's awarded a free kick. To the keeper and go again. Speculative strike. Just brushed off the ball there. Tries to get it forward quickly. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Oh, this was all about good movement in the box, just to allow him to get to it. And he's there to clear it. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's got through. And that will go straight through to the keeper. Cuts it out. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil there. And we are underway again. So deadlock still as the second half begins.
Well, he's made sure that that won't get through. Over to the left. Gets it back. Balls out on the left now. A buccaneering run from the defender. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Yes, nil-nil and little promise of a goal due to the shot-shy nature of this contest, but I'm not giving up on it. There's plenty energy on the pitch not to give up hope just yet. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Straight out wide. That's great strength on the ball. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Battles to win it back. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. He was never going to miss from there. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. And time is up. So it ends 1-0. Rolling game and an agonisingly narrow defeat. Would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Well, the surprise for me was seeing a team look so feeble in what is usually a strongly protected area, but the centre of their defence looked open and very, very...